Howdy, Grusko, bienvenidos. That's about all I got. In this video, I'm gonna go over gear maintenance, how to clean the gloves. Oh my goodness gracious, how to go over your boots. I don't know about that. How to clean suit, how to clean helmet. Me personally, I like to start off with the suit. Get the meat and the potatoes out of the way. That's the one that's most time consuming. So, if you're not a heavy sweater, then all you really have to do is wipe her down with a warm rag and you're done. All you want to do is maintain the leather. Now, if you sweat like a banshee or a heavy sweater like I am, whatever a banshee is, then you're going to have to go in a little bit deeper. And in that case, you're going to want to remove the liner, the armor, and the knee pucks. The order is your choice. We're going to move the liner. It's Velcroed usually by the cuffs. Just pull it out and rinse and repeat for all four other extremities. Holy death. And this I wash with my helmet liner together. Remove the armor from the suit and the arms and the legs and the arrow hump. And usually those are held on by Velcro. So how was your day going as I remove this armor? I hope you're having a lovely day. Let's get out of here. Come on, lad. If you have a front load washer, you can toss your suit right in on a gentle cycle with half a cup of distilled vinegar water. If you don't have a front load washer, you can do the bathtub. If you don't have a bathtub, you can do a garden hose. If you don't have a garden hose, I don't know what to tell you. I can't solve the world's problems. Sorry. If you don't have one of those little hair dryers, you can always just hang it and dry it. A little drip dry never hurt anybody. It just takes a little bit longer. Do not let it dry in the sun though. You will destroy the leather. And as it's drying, just be sure to condition it until it dries. It puts the lotion on its skin. Most helmets have cheek liners that you can remove. Little cheek pads. They're held together by little snap points that you can just carefully pull out. <laughs> And the liner is the last thing that's also held together by some snap tabs, so just be careful pulling that out. Alright. The liner for the helmet and the liner for the suit I'll do together. The helmet liners I will put inside of a bag. And wash that with the liner. Make sure to pull out all the armor that's inside of this. Gloves, helmets, and boots I just do in the sink. So I'll use distilled vinegar water in lukewarm water. So I'll just clean off the leather and get all that sweaty crustiness off. Wrap the gloves up and squeeze them gently. No mangling. Do not dry your gloves with the sun or heat, just let them air dry. You want to keep putting the gloves on as they're drying so that you can knead them and mold them back into that nice position. You want to start applying conditioner on them, just like the suit. For the helmet, I keep it pretty simple. I just use warm water and a sponge, and that's it. The boots, I'll clean them the same way as the helmet. I'll just use warm water and a rag, and that's it. Pretty easy, and then let them air dry. Thank you for checking out this week's videos. I really hope you learned something. If you have any questions about anything at all, just leave it in the comments below and I'll be sure to respond. I do respond to every single comment. If you have any ideas for topics for next week's video, just let me know and I'll be sure to include it in there. And until then, see you next week. All right, let's get on out of here. Let's go.